because uh again i gotta i guess it's not really a spoiler alert because i'm just gonna tell you right now like i guess it kind of is but it's whatever like no one pays attention to the oh full counter let's go oh oh my god i did it again i did it again <laughs> oh no <laughs> What's going on, everybody? It's Childish. We're back at it again, coming at you with another video for Seven Deadly Sins Grand Cross. In today's video, we talk about the recent update that they got going on here, the 100-day event, the step-up banner featuring Blue Merlin. Uh, we're going to do our SSR pool, our weekly SSR pool, and then we're going to go ahead and jump into some PvP and see if we can get ourselves a couple of wins. So first and foremost here, uh, I do want to go ahead and throw up the Blue Merlin uh, information if you guys haven't had a chance to check out here i'm gonna go ahead and switch to my screen and here we are so uh, uh, if you guys didn't know blue merlin is going to be part of a banner that we're going to be able to collect here this is one that we'll be able to get for free so let's go ahead and take a look at our abilities and skill set real quick here uh first skill uh looks like it's called dark void buses so it's going to be a single target attack to just a regular enemy right uh this uh skill when it's at rank two is going to be able to disable everything for disable everything but attack skills by one turn and then that's going to go up to two turns and do a little bit more damage on that rank three there so again very very similar to like a red slater per se but it looks like um the disable is kind of on the lower end it's one turn versus two turn we have to literally wait for a rank three turn whereas like a red slater he actually gets a two turn disable uh everything but the tech skills on rank one ability which is why it's actually really really good um, that being said, though, let's take a look at the rest here. Cursed Engagement is the second skill. Uh, inflicts damage equal to 100% on all, all allies and uh, decreases skill ranks here. 200% of a tank uh, is going to be the rank 2 ability here. Again, same thing, decreases the skill ranks here. And then last but not least, rank 3 on this one. A little bit more damage, but then also depletes the ultimate move gauge by the number of skill rank decreases. So this kind of reminds me of a little bit of that green Elaine there. Um, Again, I don't know. I, I haven't really used a lot of units in my lineup that have or that are really strong with regards to uh, decreasing skill ranks here. But I mean, if you think about it, people are always using red Gulther. So... Again, I'm sure it wouldn't. You know, it'd be a, it'd be some kind of a help here. Again, um, so far though, not really feeling the unit. So let's take a look at the last skill here. Uh, again, this is basically similar to any other Merlin that we got going on. This is just going to disable uh, disable their attack skills for two turns, 540 percent attack multiplier, and over 630. Uh, when you pair it up with an Arthur per se. Uh, the passive though increases the hero's attack by two percent per debuff on an enemy which I guess would make a little bit of sense if you're using something like the rank one ability here. But again, that's really not too much extra damage, right? If this thing is putting out, what, five five debuffs and whatnot here? Is that an extra 10% per debuff? Unless you're talking about other units, you're gonna pair with a lot of other debuffs here. But still, that's not a really good passive in my humble opinion here. Literally, like the only reason why I'm excited for Blue Ruin is just to have it in my Poke uh, Pokedex. And honestly, to get, the, uh, to get the cosmetic for the people out there that are, uh, you know, working on uh, the green merlin as a you know uh basically one of their main you know four units that they utilize in pvp that's literally the best thing that i'm excited about the cosmetic here but again um this is just my you know like quick you know look at it uh let me know what you guys think about this unit do you think this is something that can get jumped into pvp and do well do you think it's going to fit the meta could it counter the meta um do you think this anti you know like go through kind of skill here rank two is that going to be worth anything let me know your honest opinion about that I would definitely appreciate it. Now let's take a look at this list here. What do we still need to collect, right? We did, remember we got the green, but oh, you know what? I, I know what I want. I know exactly what I want. I'm gonna be greedy right here. Red Nunchaku Kuban, okay? That, I literally just want it for the cosmetic. His UR, I think it's uh, SSR and UR cosmetic, I would wear versus the one that you get for Fox Skin Agree Bond. So let's say I, I called it out. If I complain like I did with the Green King, then I'll get it right. I'm not trying to complain though. Because, uh, again, I got to, I guess not really a spoiler there because I'm just going to tell you right now. Like, I guess it kind of is, but it's whatever. Like, no one pays attention to the, oh, full counter. Let's go. Oh, oh my God. I did it again. I did it again. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, my God. I did it again. I just, like, how many times you guys watch my videos? Dude, stop what you're doing and press F in the chat. Pay respects to my uh, noobness. I literally... Every single week that I do my weekly SSR pull, I get so hyped up when I, it's a guaranteed SSR. Oh my gosh. Oh my God. That's so embarrassing. It's so, it's so bad. It's so bad. I legit got so excited. Oh my God. Just, just, just give me a green Liz, whatever. Just do it. Just, just embarrass me with a bad pull here. Okay. We'll take another, we, we got like three green Kings now. Apparently once you get one, you get like 40 of them. All right. So yeah, we'll go ahead and take that. We'll, we'll hold on to it. It's cool. It's cool. 
Um, no big deal. But yeah, the, the what I was trying to say was uh, for the for the uh, free, the ad free one that we got today, we got a Red Arthur. We actually got an SSR one. So I was pretty surprised about that because that's just something that we we never get here. Now, I'm going to go ahead and skip this because we're not lucky enough to get Hey, Red Slater. Good to see you. I think we actually need you for one more skill up as well. Um, we're not lucky enough to get two SSRs with uh, with free tickets here. So let's go ahead and just run this out. And let's see, we got wow, two SRs though. I'll take it. I'll take it. That's more. That's more gold coins that I can utilize in the coin shop. Speaking of which, I'm gonna have to check and see what we got. Is it your own currency? Yeah, right. Oh, okay. I was gonna say. I was listening to like, why don't you let me do the pull? It says we got one more here. All right. What? Do we seriously get another S? Wow. Wow. The luck is crazy today. Old fart king. I think I think what I might do is just bring it to UR just so we can have the oh you know what though his cosmetic I see I'm doing the same thing that I did with Bond his cosmetics not gonna work for the skinny king right you guys let me know in the chat I don't think it's gonna work here but again that's hey that's a unit that I didn't have so can we get mad we can't really get mad that's free man two free SSR SSR ones here can we do this one can we get an SSR here too what we might as well just summon them all right we're we're on fire today SSR oh that's that's yeah that's that's definitely not an SSR but all right. Let's go on to finish off the video with a couple of PvP matches here. Win or loss, we're just going to ju jump into a few and let's see how we can do. So uh, I want to put something out there because I'm pretty sure none of you all actually uh, matched me uh, in PvP. But if anybody matched me, okay, this weekend and anybody was like, wow, dude, you're like Childish is playing like a troll. Like what is going on? It's because my son took my tablet, okay? He took my tablet and he like, he just, he just, he just did whatever. He just likes to click skills. He has no idea what he's doing. He's just having fun here. So um let's see let's go ahead can we jump into you know what we can we can go ahead and we'll jump into a standard copy we've been using green bond a lot so let's go ahead and try to dust off the cobwebs in the elite uh, we got to go ahead and put some gear back on it. i think green bond has the gear so we'll go ahead and steal it from him so yeah we're gonna go ahead and jump in with this team we're just gonna pray to the rng guys that we can outspeed uh these these escanor teams because again when i run a team like this escanor goes goes for elizabeth all day every day right it's whatever it's whatever but i'm still gonna go for it still gonna gamble a little bit we'll see what happens here now uh also to kind of put it out there again um Eskinor, still not ready we got like uh six ssr pendants so i can bring him up to like level 70 right now so i'm like okay what's the point i'm just gonna wait uh until we can get ourselves so okay. wow ninety six thousand to 156 um I think you might want to uh, hop on over to Gearless, <laughs> BBB. All right, uh, let's let's do it. I guess he wants to stay. He wants to stay in for the match here. All right. Oh my God. Okay. No matter what, we're definitely doing an extra match after this. We're not. We're not gonna. We're not gonna finish off a video with just something random like that. That's that's unfortunate. I feel. I really do feel bad for this because I actually, I get up. I mean, this week I think it was at, I was at goal two, uh, goal one. And then my son, he plays, he doesn't realize he's in, he doesn't know what he's in. He's in normal, he's in elite. He plays whatever and he drops, he deranks me. And uh, just, just like, I'm just, I just laugh because I want him, I, I generally set him up to go into normal ranks because I hit champion five already. So even if he loses, he's not going to derank me. We're actually in elite. I'm actually trying to go try hard. And then believe it or not, even though, even though we have, uh, Ooh, what should we should we do it? Should we do it for it? Let's 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 try it. Let's try it one time here. I'm gonna try it. Probably not gonna work, but again, they're he's kind of low rank here, so there, there's probably a good chance that we can do this. Yeah, we can oh we can definitely do that. <laughs> we can we can definitely do that. Can we kill two people? <laughs> oh my god. I'm so sorry. I feel so bad. And he got to run red red uh red bond there. Oh why is this guy still in here? This can't be a bot, right? This can't be a bot. I mean, maybe it is. I don't even know, but I feel like, I feel like the bots, like the bots are generally like they're equal in our levels, right? They're equal in our levels. They do the little stamp. So this has to be a real person. Like why in the world, uh, are they still going? Yeah. I have no idea. Let's go ahead and try to kill this bond with the two skills. And then maybe we can do enough damage with our, uh, with our lovely, uh, Eliza Hawk, and then we'll go ahead and uh, we'll go ahead and finish up. Is that going to be enough? Oh, yes, it definitely is. Wow, there you go. Okay, well, my apologies in advance, guys. Uh, I know that that match was <laughs> not very exciting, but I'm sure we're going to find. I mean, I'm, like I said, this next match here, it's um, I'm destined. It's karma. It's going to come back to me. Um, we're going to have to deal with uh, with the Neskinar here. Wow, this guy just disconnected any battle, but at least we got the victory. It's whatever. Can you blame him for being 60k CC under me? It is what it is. It is what it is. So, all right. 
Let's go ahead and load it up once again. We're going to use that coin food here. We are, oops, we did not load up the coin food. Let's go ahead and do that. Auto food. And let's go ahead and pull it back here. Yeah, there we go. All right. So I hope that we can find somebody that is sort of close to us, but not out speeding us, right? Not, not out CCing us. That would be good. I'm looking, wait a minute, but I see, I see something floating around. Is that, is that, is that King? Is that Hellbrum? I think that might be, I think that might be a King. So hopefully it's not a King Brum. Probably like a Gother Escanor King. Pretty standard stuff. Let's see what he got here. Oh, no, it is a King Brum. Okay, here we go. So can we get the first turn? No, we can't get the first turn. And please, oh, that's unfortunate here. We're, we're in deep trouble. We are in deep trouble, okay? This, this guy's going to crush us. Like we, we literally should quit right now because that's how strong this comp is. When you don't get the first turn and you don't get the right rank up cards here. So we needed immunity. We don't got it, but we're still going to try our butt off here. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Take your time. Don't worry. We'll wait here, Marco. This Marco's like, hmm, I wonder what should I do? Should I, should I lock down that? I'm like, what are you, what are you talking about? Of course you're going to lock that down. That's the only unit that can actually cleanse. So yes, that is a unit to lock down. And he got, he got the right card. He got an extra Get an extra card from the uh, from the unit, so it's like, uh, you know what? Do we do it? I mean, no. I just I don't know. I'm gonna I'm just gonna go ahead and do. I'm just gonna do this here. I'm gonna do this, and we're gonna go ahead and bring that in just to rank it up here. I don't I don't even think like I don't know if I can get out of this, but I'm gonna I'm gonna try. No, like so normally if I wasn't recording this video right now, I probably would have just quit because I just King Brum. Everybody knows it's toxic. Uh, it's all heck here, right? So I'm just like, I'm done with that. I don't want to mess with it. It's whatever. But now I'm actually excited to see because he, he still has Hellbrooms. He still has Hellbrooms uh, CC ability here. Um, I don't know if he has another rank up, though, from Gother, right? So if he disables me, oh, my gosh, you would do that. What are you going to do here? Who are you going to CC? Okay. You know what, though? That's okay. That is perfect, okay? Now, here's the thing. Look, take note. Take note, right? We got... We got our rank ups that we need to go ahead and get uh, Blue Liz out of the out of the out of the immunity here. Uh, and the good thing about this is, is that Red Hellbrum doesn't have his ults, right? His ults are really, really behind. So we're going to be we're like, we don't have to worry about him stripping our immunity here. So actually, we are in a really, really good place right now. The only downside is, is that um, they can still push back my ult. So I cannot I cannot snipe the Hellbrum. I kind of want to take out the Hellbrum um, as soon as possible because I don't want to lose that immunity. So. Please, for the love of God, don't don't one shot me. That would be great. And luckily for us, they don't have a double ult right now. Double ult would. Wow, that blue king did massive amounts of damage. Got to give it to him. That that was pretty good. That was pretty good. OK, so here's the deal. Uh, What do we go? I think we go for this one, right? Uh, Let's let's do this here. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Let's let's try. I'm going to try to do this. Oh, you know what? I'm in trouble. I'm going to try to do two here. I think that's going to do it. And then I'm going to go, I'm going to go healing over here. Yes, that's definitely going to do it. All right. Good job. Good job. All right. We got it done. Gother's down again. I, I feel, I feel like we probably like, will Gother really like, what do you guys think about that play? Do you think that was a good play? Cause I feel like, honestly, I probably should have taken out one of the two CCers. I probably should have done that. That would have been, that would have like saved me the trouble because go through all he's going to do is, you know, enable other units. But if those units are not there to enable them, then what's the point, right? I mean, Helbrum would have made sense because Helbrum is the only one that could stop us from doing our alts. So yeah, I think, I think that's a misplay on there. If they get the win, I'm going to have to give it to them. But at least, oh, wow, that was super close here. Go for somebody else. No. All right, all right, all right. We got to come back. How do we get back out of this here? Um, Let's see, let's see. Wow. Did he push back? Why did he push back that one? That's interesting. Okay. So definitely taking out the Hellbrum. Yeah. This actually may work. This actually may work. Okay. We, we take that out. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and do this. Oh, should we do that? No, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Hold on. We, we do that, right? Let's rank up and then let's go ahead Let's go ahead and do the attack disabling, right? I think that's the play. I, I kind of wanted to, I kind of wanted to combine um, those skills so I can get two turn wreck, but but he still has the disable for the next turn, so I can just save it for the next turn. It's whatever, right? And we have uh, we have Arthur's ability, so we'll be able to refresh that next turn, right? This is good. This is good. All he can do is literally buff and potentially CC me, 
but he's only CC in my Merlin, right? So we're in a good spot here unless he just, wait a minute, what happened here? Wait, wait a minute, did I not see that? Oh my goodness, I did, yeah, no, I didn't even notice that. I, I wasn't paying attention, I didn't even notice they had it. So my question is, did I have that? Did I have that? I don't think I had that Merlin skill prior to, um, which is unfortunate, all right. Let's see, uh, I don't know if it's gonna be enough. Should we go, you know what? Oh man, this is gonna be unfortunate. This is gonna be, this is super unfortunate. Oh, I'm get, can I gamble? Should I gamble one time? Should I gamble one time? I think I'm, I think I'm gonna try. I don't like the play. I feel like I should have gone for the Merlin, but if we can act, oh, that definitely not. We needed to, we need to double crit there. That would have been, well, we double crit there, but just not enough damage. We really need that attack. Well, that's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Ooh, you know what I just realized? Uh, if he doesn't have any CC and Merlin doesn't use the shield, we may be able to attack buff and then do rank two Merlin ability um, on that blue king. I hope it's gonna be enough. Let's try, let's try. Cause we, I mean, we can take it out right now. Arthur's not gonna have a problem doing, dealing with Merlin, right? Come on now. Oh man, that is so close. Brutal, brutal, brutal. Okay. Dude, this is, this is way too close for comfort here. And we don't even have our ult right now. At least blue king can't heal but he still can CC the crap of us, which is what's gonna happen. Wow, he, I honestly, I'm surprised. I feel like he could have came back. He just might have, he must not have had the right cards. He must have had a ton of cleansing abilities. He just might not, might not have been getting the right cards. Here. Okay, one more, one more, we gotta do it. Because again, the first one doesn't count, right? The first one doesn't count. Let's go ahead and see uh, if we can deal with, let's let's bring in the Escanor. Now I'm ready for the Escanor here. If we can finish off with the Escanor, I'd be really, really happy. Come on now, let's see what we got. Oh man, I hope, I hope we can get it. Oh. There, there's the, I feel like that's the Escanor here. It's coming. It's coming. Here we go. Oh, and we got the, oh, I'm excited. I'm excited. And we got the first turn. Okay, okay, okay. Come on, get the right skills. Get the right skills. Oh my goodness gracious. All right, I'm in trouble. I am in trouble, but we'll go ahead and put our buffs up. Let's do this. We'll put this up. And should we just combine? I might as well, just so we could prevent Escanor from doing Escanor. I feel like, I feel like this is one of those things where like, even if we lock down Escanor, like, is it really gonna matter? Because he still has Blue Demon Meliodas to back it up, right? So that's unfortunate. But, ooh, ooh, okay, okay, okay. So let's see what he decides to do here. Is he gonna load? Yeah, here we go, Corrosion first there. All right, all right, cool, cool, cool. This is good. This is actually really, really good for me because um, we got two debuffs here. We're gonna be able to go ahead and we're gonna be able to go ahead and uh, cleanse it, right? Oh, should we do it? Should we? Should we put the? Should we do the AOE? Oh man, I'm like so I was thinking about just cleansing, cleansing her, and then doing some damage on somebody here. Oh, I think I want to. I think I want to go for it. This is this is not the play. This is not the play. But I'm gonna gamble because I'm gonna have five buffs. I, we might be if we get a nice crit on the Arthur. This is gonna be kind of scary. Come on, crit, crit. Okay, that's enough. That's enough right there. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Yes, sir. Let's go. That's what I wanted to do right there. Again, Escanor can wreck the Elizabeth all at once. I just want to blue the million to be done with it. And remember, guys, he was holding on to his attack card here. All he did was the corrosion, right? So um, I think we're we're gonna be in a good spot here. We literally got our ult from from the uh, Arthur, and now he's gonna be at a huge disadvantage here because we're gonna snipe that. We're gonna snipe that Escanor all day. Again, we have a six six Arthur. That was the one unit out of all the SSR. Um, you know, pulls that I got early on in the game. Um, that was the one that we got the most amount here. Literally six six it after a, after a couple of weeks here. So, oh my gosh, did you did you did you forget? Did you forget Blue Liz can take it out? Did you forget? Oh, cleanse that attack buff. And I feel like this might be the wrong play here, going after Escanor, but I'm gonna try. Because like sometimes guys, I, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah, we got the attack buff, okay. Sometimes I like to gamble and I just go for the blue king because we get the higher crit chance. So I just do it, try to snipe it and be done with it. Um, but it is what it is here. All right, blue king. At least he's not going to take out the uh, Arthur, right? Now, blue Liz is gone. But as long as, as long as the Gotha can stay alive so I can uh, disable the Hauser, then I'm, then I'm okay. Then I'm okay. Blue Liz, bye. Yeah, you, you did good, hon. It was good. You, you put in the work. No problems. Let's see here. Oh my God, look at that damage though. Again, the, the kings that are coming in now, just massive amounts of damage here. Unbelievable. Oh my goodness. Please don't do it again. Okay, okay, okay. What do we got here? What do we got? Uh, here's the deal. Let's go ahead. I mean, should we do it? We should, I don't like this spot here. 
Oh, wait a minute. Wait, we got we got to do this one time. We got to do this, right? Um, then we got to we got to go like this and then like this here. So now now he can't he can't heal his his guys, right? Um, he can't, you know, cleanse off the disabled. He literally all he can do is if he got the right cards, he can go ahead and uh CC one of our units here, which is fine. He can CC one and that's it. Um, because he only has two skills, right? Unless he gets like a crazy amount of of debuffing ability. Yeah, all right, all right, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, we we got to lock down here again. Like Arthur, I just he the the the, the heal lock, the the cleansing lock there. It's so important. That's what I was having fun with the other day. Not just with Arthur, but even Red Slater. So important to throw that down on the Blue King here. Once you once you take away this ability to cleanse and get reset. I mean, it's just it's just hard hard for them to deal with. But uh, yeah, I think we're gonna go ahead and end off the video uh, uh, at the end there. Again, we should have a couple more videos coming out this week here. So again, uh, don't you worry, guys. We're gonna be still putting out content. I know we've been uh, doing a lot of stuff lately with you know uh, the regular videos and my summer tour videos and sponsor content. So I'm gonna try to get in as much as I can. Again, I'm enjoying this game just as much as I did a uh, hundred days ago. So uh, just stay tuned. We're gonna be bringing some more your way. Okay, that's gonna be it, guys. Thank you all so much for tuning in. It's your boy Childish, your Childish Place, checking out. Take care, and we will see you all in the next one. I'm out.